end of february 2021 we had just finished our north sikkim birding trip of 7 days and along with our guide from sikkim lakpachi we were on our way from gangtok in sikkim to lava in northwest bengal suddenly lakpachi exclaimed great on bill and a vehicle braked to a halt i jumped out with my binox and severed the sight of this huge pied bird with black band across its white tail perched and preening on a tree just along the road it had a long deep bill with a flat cask double pointed with a black rim indicating this bird was a male of the species this great hornbill was obliging and it allowed all us photographers to assemble our gear and take photos we could observe its white head and neck brushed yellow and its black rimmed red eyes I had missed spotting this bird in three birding hotspots and here in Sikkim where it is not so commonly spotted I had a surprise sighting of this lifer and that too on a busy road with traffic passing by and vehicles honking and this great hornbill made his voice heard despite the traffic sounds within a week of this sighting when at Rongtong in northwest Bengal I had the privilege to observe this bird again this time I spotted it during feeding time i never thought this huge bird with such bright white black and yellow color would in any way get invisible in any tree but when this bird put its head down in the tree to feed it nearly disappeared in the thick foliage while staring through the camera i could capture this bird with its eyes closed in february 2020 i had been to lat panchar and had succeeded in getting a sighting of the rufous necked hornbill multiple times but either it was too far off or made only a flitting appearance the desire to observe this bird peacefully was only fulfilled during my trip to the same place in 2021 after having patiently waited on a mountain slope in the middle of the jungle near a fruiting tree for 5 hours the female of the rufous necked hornbill made its appearance As she settled on the fruiting tree, she called out to its mate, but he did not follow her. She then started feeding on this fruiting tree. It was amazing to watch this bird hopping very slowly on the branches in search of a ripe fruit, balancing its huge mass, twisting its head, and adjusting its beak to have a go at the fruit. Her movements seemed to be done with great yogic poise. With a little prodding from our guide Pranesh we observed that the bird does not eat this fruit but rather the seed of this fruit the reddish orange color of the fruit it was feeding on matched its inflatable bare throat skin having done with the feeding it was time for the hornbill to rest though it was resting a closer look revealed the bird was alert and was observing everything around with its eyes rolling we were content with this sighting but there was more to come next day evening we were birding along the road and spotted the fork tail on the left side of the road making its way up the stream as we were busy trying to get a glimpse of this retreating bird the most novice of birders amongst us slowly whispered hornbill and to our utter surprise and joy on the right side of the road just 10 feet away from us perched on a tree was the male of the rufous necked hornbill As we stood observing this majestic bird with rufous head, neck and underparts, long pale yellow bill with black stripes, blue bare skin around its red eye, a black tail with white distal half, I had the feeling of elation that most people feel when they spot a tiger in the jungle. It was a majestic sight to see this huge bird preening with its beak. which has saw like cuts and cleaning itself with its claws while flaunting its rough socks for me this was bliss